Hey guys, welcome to Total Evelyn and it is only three days before Christmas so I'm about to set the table. I like to have my table all set two or three days before Christmas because it gets me in the mood. The only thing I forgot to do was to buy the crackers. It will certainly be looking very festive indeed by the time I'm finished with it. Join me after this real short break. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to Total Evelyn. Does anybody else get as excited as me when you're doing your table? <laughs> I'm just... Ding, ding. I bought these out of the range in Edinburgh. They're little runners. So what I've done is I'm cutting them up because I'm going to make them into placemats. And it's just really quite cost effective and it makes your table look a bit jazzy. I'm not a big fan of tablecloths. I don't really like tablecloths. I prefer runners. I think that's the new thing now. People don't have tablecloths anymore. Even if you look in the restaurants, it's just the bare wood. Lots of coasters, so they'll be scattered about. And I got some really beautiful glasses out of TK Maxx. Nice silver. Red wine, we're going to have a pie. Well, after a year of COVID and restrictions, then I'm sure we really need to be drinking. So we've got cocktails, we've got red wine, we've got white wine, and we have champagne. Champagne glasses are so stunning. Six come into my house for Christmas dinner, which is small for me, so it's nice and easy to... This year, I am not using plates, I'm using plastic plates. Plastic plates and plastic cutlery, because I'm going to throw the rest of it in the bucket once we're finished. My dishwasher is not working. I want to have to be doing dishes. I want us to try and, try and relax as well. <laughs> I'm going to put this one on as the runner. Maybe I should have put the runner on first, but let's do it fast. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> Big child. I said don't be perfect, but I am a bit of a perfectionist, really. <laughs> it's, we have 150 piece. Rose gold rimmed dinner service. Wait till they see that they're <laughs> plastic. Well, they're all going in the bucket afterwards. I'm just going to get a big rubbish bag right after dinner. Nobody's doing any work apart from glasses and things, but you know, you can never have enough dishes. So I thought this was a splendid idea. What have I done? One, two, three, four, five. How come I've got seven? We'll just do eight in case there's some more people arrive. You never know with my family. Got our side plates. What a genius idea. Looking good. Christmas pudding. Napkins. Now do you see why we don't need to have a tablecloth really? Because the table is completely covered with the centerpiece. I'm going to put all these on top anyway so that you can accommodate the hot food coming out the oven. And we're not finished. We have plastic forks and plastic knives. <laughs> Rose gold. And they look and feel fabulous. In fact, I really think I might not want to put these in the bucket. This was an amazing deal from Amazon actually. Figure out how much they were and I'll send the link because for next year you can't go wrong. You get cups as well, usually for the kids, good for the kids, but also for water. We have little things for the middle, maybe for some snacks. Look at these. These can all go in the bucket as well. My kids are going to freak when they see this. They're going to think that I've splashed out and bought really expensive 
knives and forks, and then they're going to pick them up and go, oh, maybe nobody will even notice because they do feel quite good. Maxine's the only one that knows what I've done. So she can't wait to see Robin and Jamie's face. It's a good idea, you must admit. <laughs> what do you think? Would you do this to your family? No, it saves washing dishes, doesn't it? Nice water cups. <laughs> Sorted! <laughs> Isn't that look nice? to get is crackers, wine and food. <laughs> but anyway, that's it looking very, very merry. Listen guys, thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you on Christmas Day when I'll be showing you what I bought from Michael Kors and hopefully I'll give you a demonstration. Whoops, it's a fair one. Mwah! Take good care, enjoy the lead up to Christmas and be merry and safe. Lots of love, do remember to subscribe, like and share and don't forget to hit the little bell for the notifications. Mwah.